Welcome to Academic Game Tutorials. In this video, we are going to learn about the selection criteria of engineering materials or the conditions that are taken in consideration while selecting materials for any purpose. But, before we begin, if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, just click on subscribe and press the bell icon. Here, we come up with new videos on different subjects to make the academic studies easier for you. So, into the topic. The quality, performance and life of an engineering product all are affected by the engineering material being used for manufacturing that product. Hence it becomes necessary to select a suitable engineering material for a successful engineering product. For selection of suitable materials for any engineering application, following factors should be considered. Number 1. The properties of materials, it is the most important factor. The properties of material define specific characteristics of material, and form a basis for predicting the behavior of the material, under different conditions. The important properties of materials are Mechanical, which includes stresses Thermal, which denotes heat or cold Chemical, which includes change in property of materials with change of atmosphere, water, chemicals Electrical, includes power and current. And radiation, which includes light, ultraviolet, nuclear. Performance requirements, the material of which a part is composed of, must be able to withstand the external environment, and perform the part's function without failure. For example, the material of a furnace wall, must withstand the high temperature. We also need to consider, the material's reliability. In a given application, a material must be reliable. Reliability, is the degree of probability that a product, and the material that the product is made of, will remain stable enough, to provide service for the intended life of the product, without failure. Another important factor to consider, is safety. A material must safely perform its function, otherwise, the failure of the product made out of this material, may be catastrophic in certain situations such as in airplanes and high-pressure systems. Physical attributes The physical attributes, such as configuration, size, weight and appearance sometimes also serve as the functional requirements. For instance, the functioning of a gyroscope, or a flywheel, is directly related to the weight of the material used. Environmental conditions The environment in which a product operates, strongly influences service performance. Humidity, water, or chemicals, can cause corrosion, and subsequent failure of the materials. Availability of a material, obviously a material must be readily available, and it should be available in large enough quantity, for the intended application. In times of scarcity, this becomes significant factor of consideration. Disposability and recyclability, these are the highly significant, and increasingly important factors, in materials selection. Example Nuclear Materials A material should be disposable, and reusable through reworks and modifications. And finally, the economic factors, cost is the continuing factor, for any material selection procedure. Cost, perhaps more often than any other constraint, is the controlling factor in a given materials application problem. For every application, there is a cost, beyond which one cannot go. That prescribes the limit that can be paid for a material to meet the application requirement. The total original cost of the material for a given application is made up of two components, the cost of the material and the cost of processing the material into the finished part or product. So, cost should be considered, as another most important factor, in selection of materials. So, these are the criterions, or conditions, or factors, that are to be considered while selecting materials for use in any field of application. Thank you.